Welcome to Power TV. I'm your host, Samantha Moya, and we are here at the Unleash the Beast Mental Health Symposium in Toowoomba. But I'm sitting here with Karen Russell, a Nanango based author of the children's book, Deacon the Dragon. And I wanted to have a chat with her today about why she's here as a speaker and, you know, writing a book and, you know, really sharing her message with the community. So welcome. Thank you very much, Sam. It's great to be here. It's a wonderful event and excellent to be part of. Thank you. Um, so let's talk about, um, you were a speaker here, what were you discussing in your um, event today? Uh, discussing about uh, how writing can be cathartic in a healing process and about the book that I wrote, Deacon the Dragon is Sad, and how it uh, helped me initiate conversations especially with my nephew and, and uh, the part that it played in helping me to live a healthier life. So why did you, um, why did you personally um, want to share your story about you know, writing being cathartic and helping you through you know, mental health in the theme of, of today? Well it didn't actually start out that way, it started out as a poem and um, it took me back to a interaction that I'd had with my nephew and it ended up going into a story and I, I did it, it was something that my doctor suggested because uh, I'd finished up work and she said to try and get in contact with things that I enjoyed as a youth and I loved reading and I loved writing and drawing and so that's what I did. I just started and this, it developed, it was a two year project. Uh, as I said, I've written, I illustrated and I self-published so it was a, a huge process and to go through and try and use graphic design programs that I'd never used before and a, a printing shop and all of that sort of stuff, it was huge it, but it was so rewarding to get this out and to have the, the response that I've got back from children as to how much it's helped them. Well, even in the public speaking, right, like you said, you, it was a two-year project and, and, you know, being able to push yourself from doing that and then doing, you know, speaking, it really does show when you have that self-belief, doesn't it? Absolutely, it does, yes. Well, thank you so much for chatting with me today, Karen. It was great to meet you and um, I hope everyone goes out and buys a copy of the book, Please Deacon do. the Dragon is Sad. Thank you.